Hey Camp Champs, how is life at home treating you? For us it has had many ups and downs, mo many times of both struggle and joy. The recent unscheduled family time has been, it's been a huge gift, but it also seems my family knows how best to push each other's buttons, and we are really good at it. <laughs> I'm sure you can relate to the ups and downs and, and the family dynamics. A theme for me the last couple of days has been seeds of hope. God has given and will continue to give us reasons for hope. Don't dismiss these seeds of hope. Water them and give them the chance to grow. I encourage you to read Psalm 136 to see how the author takes time to water seeds of hope. Listen to verses 1 and 23. Give thanks to the Lord, for He is good. His faithful love endures forever. And verse 23 says, He remembered us in our weakness. His faithful love endures forever. Share your seeds of hope with each other, and then repeat the line, His faithful love endures forever. Well, Covenant Bay is particularly vulnerable to the potential loss of our spring rental season. We need to pray for God's provision. On March 31st, the Covenant Bay Board will be meeting to discuss the coming months and our response to the COVID-19 crisis and the economic hardship. Pray for wisdom and discernment and courage to follow God. Pray for the Covenant Bay staff that God will encourage them and give them hope in these uncertain times. Covenant Bay is working to produce new online and digital resources to support families and churches. Pray that God will guide our steps as we produce them together. Without significant changes to our new realities, there will be some massive cuts in our budget. You can be praying for the decision makers that they will follow God's leading and make wise decisions. I am so incredibly appreciative of your prayers. Our God is powerful and gracious, and it is good to know that we are aligned with Him. Be sure to plant seeds of hope among your families and, and others in your circle. Remember that there is no ministry apart from Christ. Pray with urgency and expectation. I will talk to you next week.